off. Hey Dougie, King Tiger comes to play. Today, the squirrels are helping Dougie fix his train set. They're almost finished when the clubhouse doorbell rings. There's somebody at the door, says the squirrels. It's King Tiger. How can we help you, your majesty? asks Betty. I'm here on official royal business, announces King Tiger. I have come to play. Woof woof, says Dougie. The squirrels can play with King Tiger while Dougie finishes fixing his train set. Yay, cheers the squirrels. Let's play. King Tiger stands in front of the squirrels' toys. He looks a little lost. Hmm, how does one play? We will show you. Oh, jolly good, says King Tiger. My turn. But King Tiger doesn't just play with one toy at a time. He plays with every single toy in the whole clubhouse. King Tiger plays with all the building blocks from the toy box, all the toy cars and all the dolls in the doll's house. He plays with all the paints from the craft cupboard and all the squirrels' teddy bears and all the cardboard boxes in Dougie's secret stash. Oh, I'll say, King Tiger is entertained. King Tiger looks around. He can't see anything left to play with in the clubhouse except oh dear king tiger has spotted dougie's train set and he's heading straight for it dougie is gluing on the last delicate pieces of his train set when king tiger gets there this will be perfect for my play palace says king tiger woof the squirrels swoop in just in time don't worry dougie whispers nori we'll handle this your majesty calls betty would you like a snack? Splendid idea, says King Tiger. One is somewhat famished. In the kitchen, the squirrels make a snack for King Tiger. But he doesn't just eat his snack. He eats all the snacks on the table. All the fruit from the fruit bowl. All the lunch in the fridge. And all the tins of food in the pantry. Then King Tiger drinks all the squirrels milk and all of Dougie's tea. Eating snacks is fun, says King Tiger. What are we going to play next? The squirrels look at each other. There are no more toys to play with. There is no more food and there is nothing left to drink. Now, what do we do? They ask. Oh, woof! Don't worry, squirrels. Dougie has finished fixing his train set and he knows just what to do. He has his royal playtime badge. Woof woof, says Dougie. It's time to play a fabulous new game. Oh, I say, says King Tiger, I love fabulous new things. That sounds enormously fun. To play the new game, King Tiger must lie down on the sofa. Ooh, it's like a long throne, says King Tiger, snuggling up. Then the squirrels take turns whispering quietly in his ear. Breathe, calm, cozy, snuggle, sleep. King Tiger joins in, breathe, calm, cozy, snuggle, sleep, he says, breathe, calm, cozy, snuggle, sleep, breathe, calm, cozy, snuggle, sleep. <sighs> Dougie passes a book to Nori and she reads the first line quietly. It had been a long day and the little king was very tired. But King Tiger is already playing in the royal land of snows. Pew, whispers Betty. Official royal business is tiring. Boof, says Dougie. Dougie puts the royal book away until next time. Well done, squirrels. You've definitely earned your royal playtime badges. Now, there's just time for one last thing before the squirrels go home. Dougie hug. Ha <laughs>